physical appearance is by exercising, guys. My melon, guys. Another thing that you can do to enhance. Hi there, I am the owner of this channel. My name is Little Little My Lady and I create content around everything that I'm passionate about. So I am back with um, part two of my three part glow up series that I started. Um, if you haven't seen it, please make sure that you check out the video before this one. So this is my take on how to glow up, in not internally, how to glow up externally. Because already I did one whereby you can glow up like um leveling up mentally and just becoming a new person the concept of low to high maintenance you know and um just to share some tips on what you can do what you can change and the things you can start doing to have this expensive um aesthetic in your early 20s so guys without wasting any more time let's jump straight into the video so guys the first tip i would give you is to take care of your physical health as i mentioned in part one that not only does um, um like working out or eating healthy contributes to how you look or your body goals or whatever but it's good for your mental health it also releases the endorphins way like the hormones that make you feel happy you know and when you feel good and you feel happy you feel good about yourself you are confident so automatically when you walk in, into a room or in an environment you exude that energy of confidence so already if you are confident about yourself if you're confident about how you look you give off that expensive and classy aesthetic, you know. And um, under physical health, guys, I would um, advise you to eat healthy, like change your eating habits. Eating healthy is not only about eating green foods or food that's bland or boring, guys. Make it work for you. Make it work for you. And I feel like, guys, eating healthy is eating home-cooked meals more than you eat junk and food that you order out or constantly eating out you can eat whatever you want to eat whatever you feel like eating as long as you are cooking it by yourself you know how much spices how much seasoning you are putting inside how much oils and stuff so you know for me that's um, a healthier alternative also there are people who are not for smoothies there are people who don't like shakes um find something that's um perfect for your um, personality for your scheduling if you don't have time to constantly cook you can just meal prep like it's all about finding what works for you what works for your type of lifestyle on physical health guys um, it's also about finding a routine that works for you it's either you should like you should move your body you should I'm telling you you should <laughs> but you should move your body you can find what what works for you if you don't want to run take a walk take maybe twice a week like take walks or do pilates if you can afford or you can just like access guys yes guys we have so much access to things and stuff on social media so you can just search something that works for you you can do home workouts just move do aerobics if you if you're saying you don't want to go lift weights or go to gym like constantly and consistently just find something that works for you and or you can dance go for dance something that works for you guys it's very important to move like it's very important to move your body you know so um, yeah so another thing um under physical health that i would like to touch on is skincare guys skincare also a very relative um thing um because i, I am advising my peers who are in their early 20s so obviously guys, we are not at a level whereby we can afford high-end products for, for example i use sunscreen i use sunscreen and i use the johnson and johnson baby bar soap you know so 
and it makes me feel good it makes my skin feel soft and sunscreen helps me with like pigmentation and like getting rid of my dark spots you know and also i drink a lot of water on top of making sure that i opt for healthy alternatives when i eat i drink a lot of water i don't drink um fizzy drinks i don't drink um coffee and everything that has sugar in it i'm not saying you should stop doing um drinking those if you love them but just make sure that you get enough water inside your body guys water and working out guys you guys don't want to know you guys don't want to know when it comes to your physical glow okay and find something that's perfect for your budget something that fits your budget something that you know that you can sustain for a long time and with skin guys i have learned that it's a trial and error thing like you can try things for an amount of like for a period of three to six months and then you can switch it up because also i saw guys like your skin if you're using the same thing over and over again especially like for years i feel like it, it, it becomes immune to that and it doesn't do much anymore but sometimes it can be the opposite you know if you change too much then your skin will, wouldn't react the right way i am not any skincare um professional this is me sharing um according to like my experience and i'm a person who have suffered with acne i'll show you guys the pictures right here so that you can see how my skin used to look like and the only thing that have helped me is like the herb life products like detoxing from the inside eating healthy and working out drinking enough water and i think also time man time time heals guys because i suffered from acne let me not say suffers it's an illness but i was struggling with acne for almost three years and this is the only year where i feel like my skin is at its most perfect you know so i'm um, yeah guys that's what i would like to advise you on another thing that i would like to add um advise you on is style leveling up physically and having like an external glow up your style and like having style is not about being a fashion killer or someone who dresses very colorful or whatever it's also um depends on who you are what your personality is your preferences your interests. style is all about what you find interesting guys comfortability and confidence counts as long as you feel comfortable in whatever you're wearing and find colors that suit your skin tone guys you will you will never go wrong with that so with style it's also up to what you prefer as long as your clothing is clean and guys please tell me i you guys tell us i need can we please i i know guys we um we're living in south africa and we are struggling with low shading but can we please try our best to i like even if what you're wearing is not screaming fashion or it's not like less less effort but you are clean you smell good and you have ironed clothes that counts for something you know so um yeah guys hygiene counts hygiene guys i need to we are in our early 20s and we, ca we can't afford the high-end perfumes but what you can do is as i told you guys the johnson and johnson soap that i'm using it smells good and i'm using the Mitchum um deodorant um antiperspirant and you guys have seen me going to buy it to one of my vlogs sometime last year so that because i'm a person who used to struggle with um um armpit odor like i used to have very very bad odor like in high school so i found what worked for me and so it's working for me as long as i smell good and guys i wanna if you can find a nice smelling fabric conditioner you are done because it doesn't count if you have a high-end perfume that smells nice, it's expensive, but you're putting it on like bad smelling body odor, it doesn't make sense. So just, and also guys, do you know like drinking enough water also helps, like it cleanses your sweat. So obviously like when you sweat, your body odor doesn't smell that bad because you're drinking water, so you're cleansing and detox detoxing yourself from the inside. So right now I'm going to be doing the last section, which is, hair makeup and grooming guys remember guys in one of my videos where i was doing the um beginner's makeup how i do my makeup i spoke to you guys about how i've seen someone explaining that um what is it called 
no what is it called not shaving what do you call it, guys it is when do only guys is that thing guys I think it's called taming taming or whatever but it's not shaving guys I will find and I will write it here but I told you guys that I was scared but look at me right now guys didn't I tell you guys but very soon I will come back and I have done it look at me guys <laughs> so guys grooming and it includes grooming your eyebrows I've also started doing that and obviously I also have beard so I groom my beard and nails guys taking care of your nails even if it's not something that looks dramatic like this you can stay with your natural nails and just put on gel you know and clean nails you can grow your own natural nails as long as they are clean it's all about cleanliness guys as long as you are clean guys trust me you are perfect the way you are so with makeup i know it's also a tricky um topic if you don't like makeup it's fine but for someone who says i can't do makeup but i would like to try it on and i would like to look good and stuff trust me guys putting on makeup is not about the fact that you don't have confidence in how you look or you feel like you are not pretty enough without makeup guys makeup your evening i as the meaning for the sunshine if you can know how i feel and I feel exactly the same way now. As you guys can see, I'm shooting this video with bare face. Just have lashes on. But, me guys. And in makeup, guys, it enhances the features that are already there. So if you see someone who looks prettier with makeup, that means the features are there. They're just enhanced. It's like going to gym. When you go to gym and you start looking better, it, your body was already like that. It's just that you worked on it and you enhanced it by constant, consistently and constantly going to gym, you know? So anyway, guys, makeup, it enhances something that's already there. So makeup and try something that's light, also something that works for you. Now, guys, I'm at a point where by lashes that are big and colorful, I don't know, I don't know, guys. JDP era, your bar, soft glam, but soft glam, 80, she has makeup on. My bonagal highlight. My bonagal cold. But it was soft. I don't know if you guys get what I'm saying, but now that's where I'm at. But when I, if you're a person who says, like, I just want to put on um, foundation, put on lip gloss, that's cute. Good for you. If you're saying, like, you want the dramatic lashes, you want the green and yellow like rainbow um eyeshadows that's also good for you if it makes you feel good about yourself then by all means do it baby with hair guys i'm gonna start taking care of my hair and i'm gonna stop like making my braids last for three months i did that yes guys i did that and i'm so proud of myself you know but now guys i enjoy um working with my natural hair like this but it's just that it's a lot of work and sometimes it's not consistently like a nice afro natural hair sometimes it looks very bad and i have to embrace those days so if you're a weave person wear your weave take care of your weave take care of your hair wash your hair that one is for me wash your hair wash your hair girl wash it it's not guys you know uh, and i'm 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 a person who goes to gym so i sweat a lot i'm actually supposed to be washing my hair every three days or two but anyway guys like with hair take take care of how you look guys make an effort if i could tell you guys how things have changed how people have started treating me since i started like making an effort in how i look even if i don't go all out with makeup or whatever but you can see that i make an effort in how i look you know you your son <laughs> you guys don't know so um another thing that you can do to enhance your physical appearance is by exercising guys my man guys another thing that you can do to enhance um your physical appearance is by accessorizing guys 
accessories are not that expensive but you can make an investment by buying the ones that are a bit higher priced you know this goes for necklaces earrings um rings if you're not a ring person it's fine guys or buy yourself a nice watch or a nice bracelet you know and you can wear nice little earrings just you want you could be wearing a very simple outfit but if you put it like put on a nice necklace or earring you're gonna look very good and you're gonna like, like be elegant you know and another like thing to have is like I'm um, owning hats and um, shades that's part of accessorizing your outfit so that you can even if you know you didn't do much everything that i'm preaching right now i practice it so yeah guys we have come to an end of our part two video the part three will be me um giving you guys i'm gonna do a style with me for summer you know like top five clothing items to have to look hot this summer i don't know if it's going to be five but this is a guys i love you guys so much i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you haven't subscribed yet please make sure you click on the subscribe button and if you don't have your notification bell on please click the notification bell so that you can be notified every time i post a new video maybe you haven't seen um my in instagram story or you're just busy and you didn't see that i've posted a video so please click on your notification bell and subscribe your comment on me guys you need not comment comment on me for my sake i love you guys so much